Finally tonight, America Strong, the family photo, now home. Take a close look at the photo that Victoria Johnson found in a book that she bought at a used bookstore in New York City years ago. For some reason, Victoria said she wanted to hold onto that photo because she wondered about the family in the picture. And last week, after years of holding onto that photo, she decided to post it on Twitter, wondering if she would learn anything more. Right away, the clues. One person writing the books are the Lincoln Library of Essential Information, if it helps. Another saying, the photo in the background is Dream Lake, Rocky Mountain National Park, Colorado. A third writing, that's a mid-century cane barrel back armchair. And then, Carol Howlett from Hudson, Ohio wrote, I think that's my Uncle Sheldon and family. And it was. Hi, David. Tonight, Victoria and the photo. It was about helping humans connect with other humans. Something that's been hard in some ways during the pandemic. Victoria carefully putting it in an envelope and sending it to Richardson, Texas, to the little girl in that photo, Valerie Suddeth. She was just nine years old at the time. She's now 65. Hi, David. Valerie with her family photo, now home. She had never seen it, but she remembers the time, the new haircut. And after having lost her father, it was the first photo with her mother's new husband, her new dad. My first impression was, that's my new haircut. And I was really, really happy because I had a new dad. Tonight, Valerie grateful to Victoria for saving that photo all these years. This was social media at its finest, meant to do what it is supposed to do. Wow, well said. That photo, now home. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.